Welcome to WolfSports.com. The Woodlands Lady Highlander softball team came into Friday's state semifinal against San Antonio Southwest, clicking on all cylinders, scoring a total of 98 runs in the postseason. Uh, Abby Landcamp set the tones for the Woodlands as she struck out two of the first three Southwest batters to begin the game. The Lady Highlander bats came alive quickly in the bottom of the first. Leadoff hitter Aubrey Leach singles up the middle to get it going for the Woodlands. Leach then steals second. Sydney Salmon's next up, gets an infield singer, and just like that, the Lady Highlanders have runners on second and third. Caitlin Stavanoa singles to center field. Leach scores, and it's one to nothing, Lady Highlanders. Shelby Dublin steps in and then hits into a fielder's choice that scores Salmon's, and here we go. It's two nothing, the Woodlands with nobody out. Abby Landcamp helps out her own cause with a hard single to right field. Stavanoa come on down, and it's three to nothing, Lady Highlanders. The inning continues with Brittany Mann getting a single and RBI to right field. That scores Dublin, and it's four to nothing, Lady Highlanders. Amy Samara gets in in the hit parade with an infield single to third base. That scores courtesy running Kerry Martinez, and the Lady Highlanders are flying high with a 5-0 lead in just the first inning. In the bottom of the second inning, the Lady Highlanders would score two more runs when Shelby Dublin singles to score Sydney Salmons. Then Abby Landcamp gets a sack fly to go, scoring Savanoa. And then the Woodlands has churned out a 7-0 lead just after the first two innings of the ball game. Abby Landcamp continued to be dominant. She went four innings, scattering five hits and striking out four Southwest batters. Southwest got a run in each of the third and fourth innings to, to cut the Lady Highlander lead to 8-2. But couldn't continue the rally. The Woodlands continue to pound out the hits as they score two more in the fourth inning. Here comes Leah Starkweather. Will score on a two-base error. Then Aubrey Leach with a sack fly RBI scoring Brittany Mann. And the Lady Highlanders are in control with a 10-2 lead. The Lady Highlanders pounded out 14 hits for the ball game. Caitlin Barch come on in in relief in the fifth inning and put this one on cruise control. Then Amy Harvey in the bottom of the sixth gets a double and two RBIs to put a bow on this one. And the Woodlands takes it 12 to two over San Antonio Southwest. After the game, we caught up with Lady Highlander head coach, Richard Jorgensen. You couldn't draw it up any better. We came out and uh, like you said, start the, set the tone right off the bat, Abby striking the two batters out and then scoring those runs right up front, five runs. And uh, we were relentless, you know, our girls, you know, they bought into what we were trying to do, I and mean, they were relentless on the bases and hitting the ball and making things happen. We knew them that being just right down the road that it was going to be crazy. So, you know, and like you said, character. Yeah. Uh, all of our girls. You know. We're always looking to be intense throughout the whole entire game, and we always, when we're on the bases, you know, we're always looking for an extra 60 feet for them to bobble the ball or, like, maybe make a bad throw, and we're going for it. We always want to be aggressive on the bases. With a win, the Lady Highlanders improved to 39-3 and overall and will advance to tomorrow afternoon's Class 5A state championship at 4 o'clock against Deer Park. For WallSports.com, I'm Brian Duvall.